The temporal lobe is one of the four major lobes of the cerebral cortex in the brain of mammals. The temporal lobe is located beneath the lateral fissure on both cerebral hemispheres of the mammalian brain. The temporal lobes are involved in the retention of visual memories, processing sensory input, comprehending language, storing new memories, emotion, and deriving meaning. Structure, medial temporal lobe. The medial temporal lobe consists of structures that are vital for declarative or long-term memory. Declarative or explicit memory is conscious memory divided into semantic memory and episodic memory. Medial temporal lobe structures that are critical for long-term memory include the amygdala, brainstem, and hippocampus, along with the surrounding hyacampal region consisting of the perirhinal, parahippocampal, and entorhinal neocortical regions. The hippocampus is critical for memory formation, and the surrounding medial temporal cortex is currently theorized to be critical for memory storage. The frontal and visual cortices are also involved in explicit memory. Research has shown that lesions in the hippocampus of monkeys results in limited impairment of function, whereas extensive lesions that include the hippocampus and the medial temporal cortex result in severe impairment. Function Visual memories, the temporal lobe contains the hippocampus and plays a key role in the formation of explicit long-term memory modulated by the amygdala. Processing sensory input, auditory, adjacent areas in the superior, posterior, and lateral parts of the temporal lobes are involved in high-level auditory processing. The temporal lobe is involved in primary auditory perception, such as hearing, and holds the primary auditory cortex. The primary auditory cortex receives sensory information from the ears and secondary areas process the information into meaningful units such as speech and words. The superior temporal gyrus includes an area where auditory signals from the cochlea first reach the cerebral cortex and are processed by the primary auditory cortex in the left temporal lobe. Visual, the areas associated with vision in the temporal lobe interpret the meaning of visual stimuli and establish object recognition. The ventral part of the temporal cortices appear to be involved in high-level visual processing of complex stimuli such as faces and scenes. Anterior parts of this ventral stream for visual processing are involved in object perception and recognition. Language recognition, the left temporal lobe holds the primary auditory cortex, which is important for the processing of semantics in both speech and vision in humans. A Nix area which spans the region between temporal and parietal lobes, plays a key role in speech comprehension. The functions of the left temporal lobe are not limited to low-level perception but extend to comprehension, naming, verbal memory. New memories. The medial temporal lobes are thought to be involved in encoding declarative long-term memory. The medial temporal lobes include the higher campi, which are essential for memory storage. Therefore damage to this area can result in impairment in new memory formation leading to permanent or temporary anterograde amnesia. Clinical significance. Features of temporal lobe lesions are as follows. Unilateral temporal lesion, contralateral hominimus upper quadrant anopia, complex hallucinations, dominant hemisphere, receptive aphasia, anix aphasia, anomic aphasia. Dyslexia, impaired verbal memory, word agnosia. Word deafness, non dominant hemisphere, impaired non verbal memory, impaired musical skills, prosopagnosia, bitemporal lesions, deafness, apathy, impaired learning and memory, amnesia, Korsakoff syndrome, clever Boussy syndrome, damage. Individuals who suffer from medial temporal lobe damage have a difficult time recalling visual stimuli. This is due to the inability to connect the visual stimuli perceived to the visual processing and interpretation centers. The most common symptom of inferior temporal lobe damage is visual agnosia, which involves impairment in the identification of familiar objects. Another less common type of inferior temporal lobe damage is prosopagnosia which is an impairment in the recognition of faces and distinction of unique individual facial features. Damage specifically to the anterior portion of the left temporal lobe can cause Savant syndrome. Disorders, Pick's disease, also known as frontotemporal amnesia, is caused by atrophy of the frontotemporal lobe. Emotional symptoms include mood changes, which the patient may be unaware of, 
including poor attention span and aggressive behavior towards themselves and or others. Language symptoms include loss of speech, inability to read and or write, loss of vocabulary and overall degeneration of motor ability. Temporal lobe epilepsy is a chronic neurological condition characterized by recurrent seizures. Symptoms include a variety of sensory hallucinations, as well as an inability to process semantic and episodic memories. References External links The Medial Temporal Lobe Memory System, HMA Euro Unregistered Trademark S. Medial Temporal Lobe Lesion, Findings from Magnetic Resonance Imaging